So good day, young people and lovers of STEM. Today, we will use Kibi and Weeby to do light tracking. We're gonna code one to move toward the light or be a lover of light. And we're going to use one to move away from the light to be afraid of the light. These are called Breitenberg vehicles and they're going to just drive either toward the light or away from the light. So the first thing we gotta do is add a photo resistor, which is a sensor that changes resistance based upon light. Okay, so I have all of the parts I'm gonna need to make this light tracking robot. I have a photoresistor for Weeby, and I have a photoresistor for Kibi. I'm also going to need a 10K resistor for each robot. So here is the brown, black, orange resistor for Weeby, and the brown, black, orange resistor for Kibi. And then because it's so difficult to see what I'm doing with all the jumble of wires, on your robot, I'm gonna put it on a clean breadboard just so you can see what it looks like, but you're gonna to have to put yours on the breadboard with your robot because we're gonna need it to track, okay? So what you're gonna do, and this is called series, you're going to put a resistor on two different rows of numbers, put the photo resistor to share one row with the resistor, and then put the other one. So here is what it looks like on your breadboard, but yours is going to be on your robot. Can you see that? I'll come in closer. Okay, and then we're gonna take three wires, red, black, and whatever other color you want. Red is for voltage, that means hot. Red is hot, okay? And then you're going to have black for ground, that means cold. We use green or black wires, okay? And then you're going to have a yellow or white, which means signal, which is going to go to A0. So I'm gonna show you what this looks like. We have a wire in A0, a wire for the red line, and a wire for the black line. Can you see that? 